YouTube, how you doing? Today I'm gonna talk about Komodo. If you install Komodo, you might get uh, an update, and you know Komodo wants to update uh, the program. That while there's nothing wrong with the program, but they want to you know install um, or you know try to get you to install other stuff that you know um, will make them some extra cash. So we're gonna look at these things and look how. Uh, it will change your computer if you do install them because uh, you know I'm not a fan of spyware and I'm not a fan of um, programs that are changing the browser into you know some site that you you know have to go do your searching that while you always already do your searching at certain places you know it's like um, they're trying to say uh, you are stupid and please well not really but you know um, of course you always have the option to uh, to turn that off but um, this year Microsoft is planning to ban all these programs that are you know uh, coming up with spyware you know they want to do something against it and these companies are complaining that uh, you know they're gonna lose money and blah 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 but I agree with Microsoft on that one because spyware is messing up the operating system and the operating system is something that Microsoft is responsible for so if they you know sell an operating system and it start running uh, buggy and do start doing things that you know it was not planned to, to do you know it was not meant to do you know Microsoft also gets a bad name you understand and that's why Microsoft decided to ban all these programs so you know um, in the coming future, we will have to look at other possibilities to get our software to buy them, you know, because free versions probably will not exist anymore because uh, the companies are not being really creative in how to, you know, uh, still make a buck, although maybe the buck is not enough for them, that while millions of users, you know, can use this program and also already probably use uh, this program but you know it went from an 80 megabyte file to a 200 megabyte file and probably it's even bigger now so let's see how big it became let's let's go to, to Google because you know everyone needs protection and you know I'm not advising nobody AVG but Komodo is going the same direction eh? let's see Komodo free internet Security 2014. Uh, free internet Komodo 2014 P6. Let's see how big it is. The size. The size is 220 megabytes. It just got 20 megabytes since my last video. You know, 20 megabytes just came on top of it. So now it's 220 megabytes. So let's see what we get for this 220 megabyte as you can see my Komodo is already installed so I will not hit like the install button but we will do the procedure just as if I will install it okay so uh, let's let's see what we got here let me close this so you see that Komodo is not a bad choice at all eh? We were already having the best. At least many of my subscribers use Komodo. I know because I told them that it's a good uh, fire scanner, and they also see it in my system when they watch my videos. And I use it for a very long time already, you know. And the people trust me when I tell them it's okay. They trust me. And the other side we just saw with with, with telling us that uh, these others were number one. These people were getting paid. The one that paid more money, that one came at number one. That's how it works. Because people don't give, uh, not always give true information. They give information to, you know, I mean, like if your friend has a shop, you're always going to say, hey, my friend's shop is good. You know, you should buy your stuff there because it's your friend, right? And your friend gives you once in a while, it gives you a little, you know, vacation money. So let's see what the installer will tell us. Okay, there we go. This is the installer. I want to enable blah, blah, blah. 
you must turn that off. Send anonymous. Just turn that off. Customize the installation and look. Oh my god. Drive dog. They want to install. They want to install Komodo Dragon Web Browser that while you're already on Firefox. And they want to install Geek Buddy. And that. So now we hit next. Now they want to enable added security by changing the DNS settings to Komodo Secure DNS Service. What does that mean? This means that your internet connection will go through you know the server of Komodo. So in fact, everything you do, Komodo will be watching you. You know, but they will also protect you because they will make sure that you will have a safe gateway. Well, I don't know what they're really gonna do, but I don't like that. You know, because there's already lots of spying on us. So I want to help Komodo by setting my homepage and search engine provider to Yahoo. Applies to all supported browsers. I think this is brutality, eh? Brutality to want to change my homepage. You want to? Maybe I have my site. Maybe I'm a I'm an office, you know, or I'm some shop, or I'm some artist. And I have my own and a start page and I don't see this I just hit it next because I think I'm smart and that I'm a great installer and I know about computers so we just hit next next because you will never think if you think about it you will not think that a fire scanner will install things like this you know a fire scanner is not supposed to install an uh, extra things that has nothing to do with the fire scanner a thing like a browser why should they come with a browser is their browser better than firefox or m maybe internet explorer really then why isn't it uh, somewhere on top in the listings of browsers we never did a browser check which browser is the best but i can tell you you see this one here on top it's the very very blood clock best browser ever created Firefox because it was not created with the intention to make money Chrome is also a very good browser Chrome you know works a little bit different it's like a commercial browser you know you know it's different you know if you know who's behind Firefox these are nice people you know people that didn't make Firefox for money these are Linux people you know that's why so i don't want to do this i think that is really not so nice agree and upgrade so in fact if i hit next now you know we won't get anything more you know so this was it these things here you know and that stuff so what we in fact got extra was this i think they also updated some stuff there so I think that's the 20 megabytes. I'm not sure. And I'm not gonna do it, but this is how to install Komodo in a safe way. And we also took a, ch a, a little uh, check. We also checked out uh, the other uh, yeah, possibilities. And you see that you're still using the very best, uh, uh, yeah, the very best internet security already, you know the best free antivirus we can also take a look here what this guy is saying let me see if this guy is worth it to talk let's see what he's gonna tell us i don't know why the screen got dark free suits there you go two of the products have included iron technically free standalone and crystals both komodo internet security 2013 and so alarm include firewall protection and other security suit features but really if you need free antivirus protection why not grab a free suit it turns out that this isn't necessarily a great idea sauna alarms firewall is the editor's choice 
in its category, but the antivirus component doesn't match its quality. If you're after a free suit, Komodo is a better choice. You might also choose to combine Sun Alarms Firewall with AVG antivirus. Oh my god, AVG, no, 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 they want to put AVG too, but uh, uh, I'm scared for AVG, I hate AVG. Uh, just like Sego, it's a, it's a provider here. I hate them. Uh, there was a guy of, of them at my door. I, uh, I'm from Sego. Do you? Uh, I say, hey, you're from Sego, bro. No offense to you. You, you look like a good guy. You know, you shouldn't be working for these people. You know, I mean, like, I don't want to know nothing about them. I don't even, I don't want to see that name. You know, if I see that, it's like a bull seeing a red cloth. You know, that is happening with me. So you're already having the best people. So the best thing that you can get for free, the very best you can get for free is um, Komodo Internet Security. But then again, please be careful how to install this, uh, this virus scanner because it might you know, change things that you don't want to be changed in your browser, etc. And um, also the settings, I think uh, if I can say this straight up to the boss of Komodo, um, you know, sir, it's really nice that you're offering a free antivirus, but it's really not cool that you guys are inserting certain tools. You know, I don't care if you guys make money with that or not. You know, I don't care if Yahoo pays you guys to set there. I mean, like, if you would set it to Google, I would set yes. You know but you guys don't set it to google so you know i don't want to be set it to yahoo and i don't think it's nice of you guys to already you know turn that on for the people you know that is really impolite so you guys must get some more uh, manners out there you software makers you know it must be like way back in 1996 you know when you would install uh, a program it would really nicely ask you you know uh, it would not turn off and turn on anything it would just you know uh, ask you if you want to do that then you must click that on and then you are also helping the company and many people at that time were then turning that on but probably also many people did not do it you know they just hit it next 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 so the developers thought well then we're gonna force them to then turn it off you know so we're gonna put it we're gonna select it you know in the front for them already so that is not a polite thing to do it would be really nice if um if fire scanners and firewalls would stay to their you know to their mission and that is not to come with other uh, little nonsense tools that has nothing to do with jig body i mean like what jig body the quarantine is there what jig body Cheek body is not needed, man. It's nonsense, cheek body. You know, and this this browser you guys put in is nonsense. Why should people use your your browser? You're not a browser company. I mean, like you have a firewall scanner and a firewall. Stay to that, and you know, keep promoting that. You know, put your Facebook link there, and we will like your page. I'm sure people will go up there and post enormous uh, messages how great Komodo is and that Komodo is the god of the free fire scanners and that if you buy it you can also give away some packages make some people happy give away a package once in a while you know uh, put the bottom inside if you enable this then once in a while we give away a free package and you know your 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 system might be updated uh, from one day to another because you win the package to the full version you know then you will encourage people to, you know to turn on these little blood clad things but if we only must give 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 and you guys only suck 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 then we can also go and look for other tools you guys are not the only fire scanner in the world and not because you are like number one of the free fire scanners then you know we are like your slaves we're not your slaves without us you guys are not in fucking business sorry for the f word you understand it's because of us you guys are in business we are the boss we give the orders we tell you guys what we want on our blood clad computers or we go just use linux you know if you guys cannot give us what we want one day there'll be a linux 
out there that will beat any Windows or any Mac computer in the world. Because the future is Android, Linux, you know, and not these things we're on now that are spying on us and doing all crazy things with us, giving us, you know, uh, high blood pressure. Some people are even getting heart attacks because of their blood clock computer not doing the things that they wanted to do. So this is my uh, video for today, people. Wish you the very best out there. It's King's Day. So today I spoke like a king. <laughs> I hope that the uh, boss of uh, Komodo will understand that we are the kings and you guys are the generals. You guys work for us. And uh, as long as you guys make good works, we will like you. And once in a while, you know, we will give you a thumbs up. But that's it. You know, and if you don't want to make a free version anymore, then stop the whole free version thing, you know, and put, 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 put on a, then we all go to Kaspersky and, 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 and buy a $20 free version there. What do you mean it? A, a, a full version, yeah, not free version, full version. Because the $39.50 for one computer is also a little bit expensive, you know. If it was for, for three computers, then you guys were like the cheapest, but then again, you guys are not the best. Kaspersky is the best according to you know test of well-known um, websites so komodo still lots of things to do there for you guys but we love you no no disrespect i do love komodo you know so my name is also komodo you know on my computers i have komodo so don't think that i'm like doing this no i'm doing this but you guys must stop doing this you guys must stop doing this. You must do this for the users so the users say, yeah, you know, when we both have our thumbs up, that's when we have a goal. You know, the moment that we're gonna start making videos about Komodo, how good Komodo is, just like how I do, but I don't like the spyware that you're putting in, and I must talk about that, because I'm not a hypocrite to my viewers. My viewers mean everything to me, just like how your users should mean everything to you komodo so don't set up the people with spyware and with other nonsense toolbars and with things that does not belong in your fire scanner CQ firewall protection for the user thanks again for watching people uh wish you a very beautiful king's day for my dutch people mooie koningsdag is ons eerste koningsjaar dat we hebben normaal is het altijd koning in de dag ik mis mijn koningen ik heb niks met koningen Nee, miss Moko. I miss the queen. So, yeah, I really miss the queen. So the 30th of April, I will have my little own queen day. I will not, I will not ever, ever forget my queen. But live for the king. I wish you good night, hasta la vista, until my next video. And sorry, I had to make it a little bit longer today because you know. Sometimes these people piss me off, you know, and I must talk about it because if I don't, you know, then it stays in here, then I feel bad. Bye.